Language, learning, and literacy in the early child education is really important because it helps our students discipline their mind. They become more accurate in terms of logical thinking towards numeracy. They will learn the concepts of language, like the sounds, the phonemes, and even the names of the letters and even the sounds of the letters easily if it's delivered through music and movement. I feel very privileged and pleased that the whole audience was so participating. Through combining art and music and the power of words, every single individual could make a masterpiece out of their own personality and their strengths and what they could do with it, whether it was mathematics or art or music or science. In this seminar workshop, I've learned so many things. It's because this is the most relevant thing for us preschool teachers to give a foundation of learning to our kids, especially in their young uh, ages. I learned that creative arts is one of the most important thing to a child to be successful in his or her career. So far, I've gained so much insight that I will definitely be able to take back home, to take back wherever I plan to be later on. But it's just nice to see individuals, professionals, teachers and such, um, who are able to encourage one another to tell us how we can be better um, teachers, who we can be better people, who we can be better educators in the early childhood field. One, one single determining factor of intelligence would be knowledge of words. The more words our students know, the more intelligent they become. I've been learning different techniques, some that I've already been using, but some that I am very, very much excited to use later on in my life. I was really pleased to see that when they were describing their piece of art, they were able to make all the connections about all the six lectures we have done today and to make metaphors. So through art, they just connect all the dots, which is really important. It is very important to integrate creative arts, which is very important thing to boost their confidence, not just in academic excellence, but also their extracurricular activities. It is something that you really have to be passionate about. You cannot be in the early childhood field if you are not passionate about what you are doing. For early child education teachers out there, it is very important for us to know how to use music and movement in incorporating the lessons of languages and your mercy inside the classroom. All participants here had the opportunity to be students. They got a piece of artwork. I saw the strengths come alive from every single participant and showing it to any subject they were doing. And this is actually the art of teaching. You put your whole self and your whole personality and you use all your strengths every day. You're a role model, a mentor and a motivator. My feedback to our speakers is that they are very good. They give us a clear, exact and of course a powerful knowledge to lead our school. These speakers, they have brought so much insight and encouragement. It's really nice to see not just someone who knows how to speak, but someone who's obviously had experience teaching. You truly appreciate people who take out the lengths to fly over. We have so many resource speakers here, we could get in Philippines, but it's always nice to have that international touch. In behalf of my colleagues from Bujamco Learning Center, we are very much happy to come to Hall every day. It is a great opportunity for me to be part of this uh, international seminar workshop of PACAE from Malaybalay City, Bukidnon. 
Marakul ho salamat sa inyo alam. Thank you very much. A big hands of applause to PACA for providing a seminar where we can truly learn. And I hope they continue what they do. And I hope that we can continue to work together as educators and as an institution in just developing and creating an educational system that will uphold and fulfill and uplift the future generation of the Philippines. PICAE, once more, I would like to thank you for inviting me to be able to share some of my knowledge and some of my past experiences on teaching language, literacy, and numeracy to early childhood uh, learners through music and movement. I'm immensely grateful because I see the difference that you have made during all these years and I look forward for 2020 to inspire all members of PACAE again. So thank you PACAE for making a true difference in the life for early childhood teachers and automatically the students as well. Thank you.